This is the male character from Second Life. I downloaded this blend file directly from the Linden Lab Wiki. However I found a few issues with this model, and most of them I could fix, but the result is still not usable after it is uploaded. Please head on and watch what I found and how I fixed it, and maybe, someone knows a reason for why the final result does not work after uploading. The first issue is, the armature is oriented to the wrong axis. As far as I know the character always has to look towards the positive x-axis, only then it can be imported successfully. The second problem is, the mesh does not have weight groups for O mandatory second life bones. When you count the groups carefully then you will see that only 14 of the necessary 21 bone weight groups exist. And finally, the mesh is not parented to the armature. While this is not really a problem and it does work, it is still a good idea to have the parenting set up according to the blender standards. Okay, let's first rotate the armature and the mesh by minus 90 degrees, so that the character looks towards the positive x-axis. Now apply rotation. Then, remove the armature modifier to separate the mesh from the armature. Finally, we can rig the character again, by selecting the mesh and the armature, then object. Parent. Armature deform. With empty groups. Using the empty groups option here will create all missing weight groups, while the already existing groups are not touched by this operation. Now the weight groups are fixed. And the parenting is fixed as well. Now the mesh is ready for export, however there is still one major problem here. You will see this in a moment. So let's now export the mesh with the default Galata exporter. Please also note that you have to select the preset for SL and OpenSIM. Now in Second Life, when I upload the mesh to the previewer, then you see that the mesh is correctly oriented but it is collapsed to tiny strings along the bones. I do not yet know what happens here, so if anybody knows how to fix that, then please feel free to tell us the reason for this misbehavior. Thanks for watching.